Uh, baking's really important to me. Um, it feels a bit like an act of kindness. Being kind to yourself by giving yourself something to do, which for me, baking is, it's one of those things that kind of, it gives you control when there's chaos and, and solace in solitude. Baking can be an act of kindness to yourself, but also an act of kindness to other people, sharing what you've made with other people, which I think, you know, we all get such a sense of joy and achievement when we have made something and we share it with our, our friends and our loved ones. Which obviously right now is, is difficult to do. Um, can't really share things with, with friends or loved ones in the same way that we have, but we can still participate in those acts of kindness by baking for ourselves. My experience with mental health goes back a long way. I can't really remember a time where I didn't have mental health problems and that kind of black dog has been there for my entire life. It's, a, it's one of those things that's really hard to explain to someone who hasn't suffered. I have lots of different uh, mental health issues. I suffer with depression, I have generalised anxiety disorder um, and also a panic disorder. But all of these issues, they all kind of in a way stem from a lack of kindness to oneself. A quote that I, I guess, love um, is we can't hate ourselves into versions of ourselves we can love and I think that is what a lot of people with mental health problems do. They they focus on that hatred, you think oh, I hate myself so much but by hating myself I can make myself better and actually it doesn't always doesn't always work that way. Everyone's entitled to have a day where they just feel like rubbish. There's no shame in, 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 in that at all. And there's no shame in having a, a depression either. The problem is, is that we don't talk about it. Um, we hide it and we pretend it doesn't exist. Um, and if you're not on top of the world all the time, there's, there's something wrong and actually that's not true. Which, you know, when people say that they're depressed just because they feel a bit sad, it kind of starts to render the word meaningless and it's an important word for people who suffer with depression. It gives them a sense of tangibility for something that is really difficult to explain. And it's tough at times, it really is. And that you know, there, there's been a lot of times in my life that I haven't wanted to be here anymore. And that's quite a scary thing to think about. The, and I know at the moment with us all being trapped in our homes and in lockdown, mental health problems are becoming more rife. Um, and if you are struggling, please reach out to um, the Samaritans or anyone who can help you because it's so important that you get help. But do try and bake something. Honestly, you can do anything, the smallest thing with the tiniest amount of ingredients and it will just give you a little bit of calm in an otherwise crazy, chaotic world. <laughs>